Okay, so in this problem, we've got the function y equals x plus 2 and y equals x squared. And we want to uh, revolve the enclosed region of those two functions around uh, x equals 2. Okay, so first let's get, a, let's get a basic sketch of these two graphs. You've got your parabola here. And you've got your linear function, x plus 2, which basically looks something like this. Okay, that doesn't have to be perfect, just gives you the idea there. So you, your enclosed region here is this. Okay, now we want to revolve around um, the line x equals 2, which is actually going to be right here, right where there's those two functions intersect. And we can check those intersections of those two functions real quick by setting x squared equal to x plus 2 and solving and you'll get two solutions x equals negative 1 and x equals positive 2 okay which are also going to be your limits of your integral that we're about to write down okay so um, your integral that you want to set up with using the shell method uh, would be uh, volume is equal to negative 1 to 2 2 pi, remember the shell method, uh, this is going to be shell radius times shell height. Okay, and in our case that's going to be with respect to x. Okay, so we draw our little shell here, a little arbitrary rectangle that's going to get rotated around this axis so rotate that around there and you create your shell okay so volume is going to be negative 1 to 2 2 pi our shell radius is going to be the distance between the line of uh, rotation and this rectangle now this entire distance here is 2 Okay, minus some x value, the distance between here and this rectangle is some x value, the distance all the way to the line of rotation is 2. So this distance between here and here has to be 2 minus x. Okay, so that's going to be your radius, 2 minus x. Your shell height is going to be the top minus the bottom. The top function is x plus 2, the bottom is the x squared. So we've got x plus 2, whoops, x plus 2 minus x squared dx okay so there's some multiplying here and distributing uh, the integral is pretty easy it's all going to be uh, just your basic integral there but you will get a final answer of 27 pi over 2 I'll give you that so you can check it in your own work